Hi everybody, so for our historical figures um, project we had Dr. Faye Abdella and Dr. Abdella is one of the most influential nursing theorists and public health scientists of our time. Her pioneer work changed the focus of nursing theory from disease-centered to patient-centered. She received the rank of a two-star rear admiral and became the first nurse and woman to serve as Deputy Surgeon General of the United States. She was recognized with almost 90 professional and academic honors, 12 honorary degrees, and in 2000, she was inducted into the National Women's Hall of Fame. So, one of Abdella's biggest contributions to nursing was that she helped shift the focus towards a more patient-centered approach versus a disease-centered approach. In her paper, Typology of 21 Nursing Programs, Abdella outlines the areas that nurses should focus on to be able to determine their patients' needs. This correlates with Dusan's core value of professional identity because she helped to define the role of a nurse and provided information to increase their knowledge and skill. The theory also encouraged the use of problem-solving skills, which is still something that is imperative to nursing. Um, the use of problem-solving skills relates to the core value of care management because effective problem-solving skills are directly related to safety and quality of care. So another specific contribution of Dr. Abdella was a study performed to monitor the utilization of nurses in the workforce. By observing how the head nurse, student nurses, floor nurses, and assisting staff utilize their time, she was able to conclude that staffing shortages and improper role fulfillment negatively impacted patient care. On average, 10 to 50% of the time observed was being utilized on activities of other people's job responsibilities. For example, large quantities of the nurse's time were being spent on tasks such as patient paperwork, dietary needs, linens, and cleaning. This study therefore enhanced the healthcare field by forcing hospitals to utilize the staff more effectively and to make changes to allow individuals to perform within their job duties. By hiring people to complete job-specific roles such as dietitians, cleaning staff, and receptionists, nurses could focus more of their time with their patient. This work focuses on the relevance of adequate care management, the need to correctly fulfill our professional identity, and how fulfilling our roles allows us to better collaborate in the nursing field. During her role as director of the Office of Long-Term Care, Dr. Abdella developed the patient appraisal, care planning, and evaluation model. PACE was developed to improve long-term care by determining what care a patient needed, as well as the impact of care on the elderly patient. PACE required health providers to assess the patient, discuss the plan and the patient's desired goals, and then determine if their goals had been met. As a result, long-term care facilities were being surveyed and certified on their ability to meet patient goals. Prior to PACE, facilities were graded on simply having the capabilities to provide services. Not only did PACE improve overall patient care and satisfaction, it created an internal monitoring tool for facilities, a cohesive data sort of inpatient information, and an objective way to measure quality of care by outcomes. In line with Dusan's Core values, Dr. Abdella collaborated with providers and patients at long-term care facilities to help patients reach their ultimate goals while demonstrating her leadership role in the nursing community. And here is our references page if you're interested. Thank you for watching.